Well, several parents have questions after a student was found with ammunition at school earlier this week. I mean, it just isn't something that as a parent you ever want to hear. Parents understandably concerned after a gun, ammo, and a knife were found in a 15-year-old student's bag. Sources tell NBC5 it happened Monday in the cafeteria, prompting a police response, but parents weren't told until Tuesday. It's such a troubling incident to hear about it uh, 24 hours later. Uh, was 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 pretty disturbing. We're told police took the weapons and determined the teen had no intent to harm anyone. That's what's troubling parents like Chris Erickson, who has a seventh grader in the school. How did you know that he was uh, uh, was by himself? You know, like that there are unfortunately incidents, you know, Columbine comes to mind where there are multiple people acting together. And yes, maybe they neutralized this particular person and maybe he didn't have any intent of doing anything, but that doesn't mean that his buddy didn't have intent as well. Erickson says the school sent an email saying it's implementing several new security measures, which include a more routine police presence and encouraging students with the well-known expression, see something, say something. It's a little bit of a peace of mind for sure that it's, uh, that they're looking at it. Erickson says it's some much needed assurance that the school is doing what it can to make sure something like this never happens again. Now there is a question and answer session here at the Lake Placid High School and Middle School for parents starting tomorrow at 3 30. Reporting in Lake Placid, I'm Liz Strepa, NBC5 News.